Slani everybody, I am Corvo Surusio Lugenicos and welcome again to this new season of Starting Out Solitary. I am your Wednesday host and we're just reintroducing ourselves, so let's go for it. Well, uh, first of all, my voice might be a little bit broken because I'm a little sick and my mom might be coughing in her bedroom. Also, English isn't my native tongue, so if I commit mistakes and I don't correct them, it's because I didn't realize, so please bear with me with that, because that's one of my biggest struggles here. So, my pagan name for now is Corvus Ruscio, and in the last year I added this Lugenicos, which means born from, or attaining to, or coming from Lugus, which is my tutelary deity, at least for a year until the next, next Lugenia, the Feast of Lugus. I am a Celtic Iberian Credimatis, Credimatis meaning believer, and that means that I practice a reconstructionist path with uh, Celtic Iberian deities, Celtic deities in the Iberian Peninsula. The Iberian Peninsula, in case you don't know, encompasses modern day Spain and Portugal without including the islands. That means that my path tries to be as historically accurate as possible, but of course there, are, there, there, there is a huge lack of information that we have to fill in with other um, Celtic lands and cultures, with um, just guessing, with unpersonal, uh, <laughs> sorry, unverified personal gnosis, etc. That's my religious path. I've been in this path for five years and like three of them have been on my own. Uh, at the beginning I was in a group, but the group was not dissolved. It took another path that was not religious and I started researching on my own. So I'm not new to this path. I'm not starting out, but I'm solitary. And I'm also learning about witchcraft. And that's been one or two years, only very slowly moving, very slow pace with it, uh, because I can't practice as much as I want, and because I want to have the theory like very well based upon um, folklore and historical facts and what our ancestors, which ancestors did. My main interest in witchcraft is what I and some people call traditional witchcraft. Not in the sense that there are traditions, like comments and stuff, but in the sense that comes from something historical or, or a certain belief system uh, of the past, and also folk magic. My main interest is basically folk magic, um, the folk customs of our peasant ancestors, etc. And my area of interest is also the Iberian Peninsula and Europe in general. But yeah, the Iberian Peninsula has different, even Spain as a country has different cultures, different cultural areas because at the beginning they were different kingdoms. So witchcraft in, er in each area is very different. The Basque witchcraft and the Pyrenean witchcraft is different to the Catalan witchcraft, which is different to the um, Castilian witchcraft to the Galician witchcraft to, to the um, uh, Andalusian um, folk uh, saint sorcery etc. They're all very different. So I don't have a focus for now. For now I consider to focus on a region in the future if I feel very comfortable with it. But uh, my main interest is basically Spain especially those areas that um, are linked to my family tree because in my religion I'm very, I'm very orthodox with keeping it with a certain cultural area. I don't include Iberian things, I don't include other European things, etc. 
this witchcraft, this folk magic is a way to explore the ways of my other ancestors. Um, I have um, Basque ancestors, I have Castilian ancestors, I have French ancestors. So my main areas of interest are those linked to my ancestors, like the sorcery in Andalusia, uh, Basque witchcraft, which is very famous, I guess, um, all of that. And as I said, I'm going very slowly because I don't have time and I'm learning on my own and practicing on my own and experimenting on my own. Um, I'm working mainly with spirits. To me, the main source of witchcraft, of the power in witchcraft, is spirits of all kinds, the Gany Loki, the, the, the Numens of power of the landscape, and other spirits. And I'm working with herbs as well. I'm starting to work with herbs, but I am very animist or animistic. I don't know how it should be said. I believe that everything has a spirit and I work not only with the object or the pieces or whatever, but with the entity that is linked to those materials, to those objects, to those animals, to those plants. And that's basically me, my path. Um, I have a, I have actually two YouTube channels, one in, in English and the other in Spanish. They are both are gonna be in the description box as well as my blogs also, one in English and one in Spanish. The blogs are supportive, is when a video uh, contains too much of scholarly information, I will make an article to support the video and to add up everything that I forgot or that is newly discovered, etc. Uh, also my page in Facebook, everything will go, this is gonna be uh, in the description box. I'm sorry if the video is too long, I'm rambling too much, but as I said, this isn't my native tongue and I'm struggling with the words in my head. I hope that you enjoy my videos. Uh, I chose Wednesday because in Spanish the word for Wednesday is miércoles, which is coming from uh, uh, Dies Mercuri, uh, Day of Mercury, and Lugus was interpreted as Mercury by Romans. So that's his day and I'm super happy that I could actually pick Wednesday for uh, being the host because of, uh, because he is my tutorial deity and I want to honor him as much as possible. I hope that I can help you out with things or teach you things that you didn't know. I think I have a perspective that is not very well known in the world in general but especially in English speaking countries such as the United States or um, the United Kingdom, Australia, etc., where most of the viewers are from. So I expect that I can add something in regards of help or in regards of uh, knowledge and education. And that's it. I'm gonna stop it uh, here. I'm so thrilled that we're coming back and I'm looking forward to making new videos, so see you each Wednesday, <coughs> sorry, see you each Wednesday here, um, thanks for watching, and Slania!